we think a lot about goals and resolutions and intentions, and that's wonderful, but we need to also be thinking about how we take care of ourselves to achieve those big goals. entrepreneurs we tend to do this thing where we think that we're superhuman and we can do it and just because we have all this passion that's going to fuel us and oftentimes it can until it leads to burnout and the reality is we need to know when we're in fight or flight because that's the place where we can't be creative we can't connect and we can't solve problems as well like biologically our brain shuts down and we're not able to do those things Would encourage people to take a step back and picture themselves in five years. What is the thing that you're going to look back on this time and be the most proud of? When you zoom out and you do this more right-brained, visioning, higher level thinking, you're, you're turning on the side of your brain that actually allows you to be creative. And you're not in the weeds, you're not in the day-to-day. -day. Like when you're visioning into something much bigger, you're calming your stress response. have the strength to zoom out and ask ourselves better questions for which the answers might be scary, there's a really good chance that we'll uncover something about our values that actually sets us apart. And then I think the end of the year is a really great moment to stop and have a brave conversation with yourself and reflect and listen to yourself without judgment, call out your ego, be better, do better. I think it's a great time for that.